Well, hello everyone and welcome to a Super Dungeon Explore video. I'm going to go through the Herald of Volcanis uh, digital expansion. So, let's begin with the uh, oh, arcade. Arcade classic. Oh, I was going to get those tickets. Anyway, classic. This is Herald of Volcanis mini boss, Dark Celestian mini boss, no doubt. So, Dark Celestian. Hmm, we haven't even actually been to Celestia yet. Well, anyway, movement seven. Wow, he's uh, very fast. Three actions, of course, makes sense. Range of two in melee with one star, three red in strength. That's pretty ouchy. Armor, two red. Oh, it's going to be very difficult there. Wheel, well, one blue, one red. Okay, that's a... Uh, Pretty tough. And range six in his decks with two blue, one red. So altogether his uh well his stats are pretty pretty scary. Well anyway, mind, he is immune to fire. Go figure. Uh so he has five health and of course being a mini boss, four skull points worth. So as for two actions he can use the flaming javelin, which is actually supposed to be a uh, range and not a uh, melee that was a mistake so it's burst one because let's see that dex is right there and uh, that doesn't use dex that uses strength it is supposed to be range uh, don't I check that out so anyway range six burst one with a plus one red index so that's two red two blue and um, well yeah, just fire. Yeah, I mean, it's a fire attack. That's what's a uh, flaming javelin. Right, two and uh, action points to use. So offensive action is shield bash, melee one. Of course, it's melee uh, with a plus one red strength. So uh, one star, four red out. But it's a, a range of uh, one instead of two, and does knock down. Got another one there. It's phalanx. So it's a, 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 an effect that affects yourself, or a two, plus one in armor. So there you have it, two plus one star. And of course, everyone else around him will get an extra one more armor. That's pretty tough, really. I mean, ouch. Let's just take a quick look of his uh, arcade mode one. <laughs> so, movement seven, two action points. Strength 4, armor 4, range 4, uh, 6 health, uh, still immune to fire. Flaming javelin, plus 1 strength and f uh, fire, phalanx. Well, it's an aura that affects him with a range of 2, and uh, everyone gets a plus 1 armor around him. And uh, anyone else that's around him, for monsters wise. So, all in all, that's that that's, feels like a little bit... Uh, because you could get a, a strength of five and an armor of five, which becomes very, very scary. Let's take a look at his treasure, shall we? Okay, Volcanus's mule. So, plus one green strength. Hmm, and causes fire. And here's another one. Backblast affects everyone. Wave two, push two. That uh, can be very, very good in a handy situation. But with a plus one strength green dice and doing fire as well. That's still very, very good. Uh, I don't know why he's carrying a roll around Volcanus's mule. Maybe Volcanus decided to give it to uh, the her his herald and said, Here, carry this. Yeah, you know, makes per perfect sense. So that is a very good treasure card. This also comes with a dark hero card. Dark Centurion, the Dark Celestian Hero. Move it seven, three action points, of course. So his strength is two blue, one red. That's pretty good. Uh, armor is two red. That's really good. Will is one blue, one red. Dex is one blue, one red. So yet again, his stats are actually pretty decent. He is immune to fire. He is also immune to knockdown as well. With five health, one potion, like everyone else. One action point, Flaming Javelin, range of six, with a blue dice, and Flaming. Uh, so his 
dex is for attacking is two blue, one red, and causes fire damage. That is very, very good. Two action points for a shield bash. Range of one, of course. Plus one red in strength and knock down. So two blue, one, uh, two red and knock back. Knock, knock back, knock down. Sorry, that's very good. And his potion is phalanx uh, file, uh, which uh, just affects uh, the person who drinks it. Wave five, pull four. And yet again, that could be very good for setting up lots of different uh, attacks and wave damages and blasts. Uh, I mean, uh, or even to take um, some of the people away from the more squishy heroes, as it were. So that's very good. I like that. And now for the last part, and that is the model himself. Uh, his spear is a little bent. I'll have to really sort that out. Anyway, his model is well, it's kind of pretty basic, really. You know, it's more centurion type. Well, of course, it's a centurion type. He is a dark centurion, after all. And his color scheme is dark red. Now, it's not 100% sure if that is part of these uh, Celestians' color scheme. They haven't actually been. Uh, an announced at this time of this video and I don't even know when but it very well could actually be dark red although it is kind of close to the uh, dragon back peaks and uh, uh, the inside of the volcano kind of thing where uh, if, if all the uh, kobolds are completely red but still carries is a, a spear a short sword a shield uh, you know, pretty good. Uh, it's, it's a weird way of how he's carrying his sword, though. I know he's supposed to be going to be chopping, but it's just a little bit weird, I think. So there you have it. That was the Herald of Volcanus. What do I think of this one? I, ooh, I think he's a, a, a very challenging type um, mini boss. Anyway, I have fought him before. I, uh, I was kind of scared of him for very good reasons. <laughs> uh, the however the reward if you find it for uh, his treasure I I would certainly recommend in putting it in with the other treasures as well. Uh, well as long as you have someone that uses strength. I mean why would you not? Uh, the the weapon is actually very very good. I uh, the the hero itself is uh, a good bonus as well. I mean, if you can't beat them, play them. <laughs> well, well, unless you're playing like the uh, console for the classic version, then of course you'll play them. Yeah. Uh, like I said, here's a a good, a very tough challenge. Good challenge, but tough. And um, yeah, I, I I mean. Uh, I wouldn't recommend get him, getting him straight away. That's for sure. Uh, I would, it's one of these ones that you just should wait to get him. Uh, if, if you want to up your game. More challenging and all that. So, that's actually all I have. Really, really that, that's it. There's nothing else to it. It's a, very, a tough challenge. Get him uh, later. And uh, get, that's it. So, like always... Thank you very much. Until next time, bye.